Doctors versus lawyers. Who's smarter? Who's more handsome? Who works harder in school? I brought Legal Eagle in to carry his side of the debate. Doctors versus lawyer. Winner takes all. I'll see you in the courtroom. I'll see you on the operating table. Be whoop! Woozy! Which education is harder, med school or law school? Law school. <laughs> what? No. Because you went to the easier school? No, because it's shorter. The problem with law school is yeah. that it doesn't actually teach you how to be a lawyer. You learn theories of justice. Okay. Imagine if in medical school, on day one, the professor's like, today we're gonna tell you about science. It's okay. how a lot of people learn medicine. And then on day two, the professors say, we already talked about science, but how about intelligent design? They'd say that the science people are all wrong. And then on the third day, they say, well, some people disagree with both of those, and they just go with mysticism. That's kind of what law school is like. You don't okay. learn the actual subject, you learn theories around the subject. Med school, four years, three to seven years of post-medical school training, harder to get into, clinical time, call shifts. I know a lot of legal students that have time off. Med students don't have that luxury. Funny you say that med students have no time off. You had a, an Instagram account. I did. It was devoted to almost nothing except showing that med students had lots of extra time Time on no, their hands. it was you could use your spare, your limited, highly limited. Frankly, I think you're badgering the witness. <laughs> what is the best part of school? It's hard for me to think of something because, because it's you went so to law much school, harder. It's so much easier. When people's lives are on the line. You got to really be able to dunking on med students. <laughs> You did not in, in law school? Now, having practiced for years, dunking on oh, med students. Oh, but he said what's the best part of school? I was gonna say cadaver lab. So, I, I think that's right. We only get to read about the cadavers. Okay. You guys get to actually work with the cadavers. Yeah. That sounds I'm glad you used that verb. Because people usually say play with cadavers and we don't play with cadavers. <laughs> in my head, I was, I was thinking play. What is the worst part of school? Can I put two things? I will allow you to put two things. I only needed to put one thing. Because I follow directions. Because it's so easy, you don't have any problem. Finals. Oh, true. I was going to say call shifts or money. I mean, law school is probably just as expensive, right? Well, less expensive because it's only three years. True. After, when you're a resident, you're making like $10 an hour for <laughs> five years. So right. like, you're still paying back that debt. The issue with finals in law school is that almost all of your grade is based on one test at the end of the semester. Oh, that's messed up. I mean, some schools are different. Yeah. And some schools do grade participation. Some have midterms. But often, the participation might be 10% of your grade. Midterm might be 20%, so it's still an overwhelming majority sure. is the final exam. Where did you go to school? I probably should erase this because this looks messy. I'm already done. We do <laughs> learn to write better. UCLA, baby! MIT, like MIT, Ruins. but in New York. No relation. I want to hear about UCLA because that's actually like a world-renowned institution. It is uh, the greatest public college uh, in the world. I actually went for undergrad and law school, so I'm a double Bruin. What happens with a double Bruin? This. <laughs> You get a nice suit and you have your own YouTube channel. Be a double Bruin. New York Institute of Technology. Yeah, so um, I did uh, a bachelor's and my doctorate degree in a seven year combined program in the school. And this is where my dad went to med school as well. How would you describe your professors in school? I said aggressive. I said devoted. They were really about their craft. They would be physically upset if someone wasn't learning. I think my law professors were pretty devoted, definitely cared about students learning, but I think they were very challenging too. Okay. So they were willing to get in your face, they really? were willing to debate, and they their passion came out in, in the classroom. Really? Yeah, I do remember. Uh, getting into a sparring match with my, my crim law professor. I said something smarmy like, well, isn't that just a semantic difference? Oh. And his response was, well, isn't everything a semantic <laughs> yeah, difference? Isn't say. that why we're here? How would you describe your peers in school? <sighs> that one's easy for me. I want to say something, but I don't want it to come off bad. Smart. Smart. People brought their own lamps to the library. Ah. People were down. Chair pads, water bottles that monitored their fluid intake. They were devoted to spending hours in the library. Certainly most of my fellow law students were in incredibly studious. But apart from the fact that they were just devoted to learning the law, it was still the, the highest concentration of really smart yeah. people that I've ever interacted with. What is one of your fondest specific memories of school? 
mock trial. Oh, that's gotta be fun because you're like half acting and half it's, being serious. It's super fun. I did mock trial all through undergrad at UCLA, which two-time national champion while I was there. What does that mean? Well, you're a champion of mock trials. Yeah. Yeah. What? Who well, awards it's, that? It's 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 uh, a competition like um, like debate. Grand champion. I'm sitting next to a grand. Do you have a trophy? Many. Can you imagine people walk into his room and they're like, wow, you must be really good at sports. And he's like, nah, debate. <laughs> Do you have any trophies from medical school? No, they don't give trophies because it's hard. Third year wearing that white coat. So second year, after you finish your last in classroom year, there is a white coat ceremony where if you have someone that loves you and they're in the medical field, they can put the white coat over you. My dad was busy, so they... Just had some professor in my school do it. <laughs> what was your dad busy doing? Being a doctor, probably. I don't know. As specific a figure as you can give me, how much money did you spend going to school? I wrote mine in euros. Oh, wow. He said specific. No. Yeah. Oh, wait, wait, for just three years? Holy moly. Including cost of living. Okay, I'm not including that because I lived in my dad's house. Yeah, uh, you know, I'm probably I'm probably including uh, undergrad in this as well. How would you describe your romantic life while in school? Is this how you got through law school? <laughs> oh, you're no. in a serious relationship. Grey's Anatomy, all the shows, they show so much romance, so much love. I've never felt that in a hospital setting. I've always was nervous or worried about learning. I never thought about dating. I really don't believe you. I'm not saying a relationship, but I, you had to have thought about it. I mean, thought about it? In the again, in the beginning when it was Ooh, new? Me? I had a serious relationship before I started law school, okay. and I maintained that relationship through the ups and downs of all three years. Is it true that like in med school, for example, a lot of relationships end yes. and start? Oh yeah. Uh, same thing in law school? Absolutely. So many people are getting together. I mean, you're spending every waking hour with the people in your law school. Sure. So, so people hooked up in your law school. Oh yeah. Maybe we're just like a anti-social community. Or maybe I just wasn't invited to the parties. They're like, yeah. we don't want this guy. Some yeah. people are ugly ducklings. Someday you might be a swan. Yeah, I'm, I'm looking to spread my wings and fly. <laughs> What is one piece of advice you would give to someone starting school today? I was gonna write don't. <laughs> I think people should go to law school if you wanna be a lawyer. As opposed to what? A lot of people go to law school because they don't know what they wanna do oh. when they graduate from- Really? Oh yeah. Yeah, that's good advice. What's final strategy? So we talked about how finals are decided using these issue spotting exams. Mm -hmm. And a lot of people think that the way to write a good finals answer is by memorizing as much law as possible. Okay. That's actually really not true. You have to know a lot of the law, but you also have to know how to write these special exams. And there's a real art and science really? to it. Okay. I was gonna say take one test or challenge at a time because in med school, you have so many tests. This week, next week, there's a board's first year, maybe second year, depending when you take it, third year or fourth year, again, depending when you take it. When you graduate, there's a board's. When you finish your board certification, there's a board's. Wow. And if you think about every test that's in front of you on day one, you're just gonna be filled wow. with so much anxiety that you can't function. Final question, which is harder, med school or law school? Go! <laughs> no Do you see my eagle? <laughs> if you wanna use this for your logo, I totally understand. <laughs> This is so, that's, uh, that's a quality eagle. I'll, I'll get back to you on that. <laughs> it's not so much that law school is harder for me, it's just, it's harder to practice when you're out. You're not prepared adequately. I think med school sounds like you have to learn quite a bit more in terms of the subject area covered. Maybe I'm gonna change my mind, I don't know. <laughs> it, look, it's the legal <laughs> You You watch TV shows on your channel, right? I do. You think there's like a Grey's Anatomy episode that has legal stuff in it? You think that there's a, a medical procedural that doesn't have a legal malpractice trial somewhere in there? A real doctor slash real lawyer will react to Grey's Anatomy because you want it. Tune in soon. I'll see you in court. Oh, medical. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs>